Hit him in the All right, guys. Ah, fuck. Now my fucking drink is gone. Haven't even started my fucking rant, and, and, and I turn around, and, and, and my motherfucking drink is gone. God fucking damn it. Where the hell is my drink? Ah. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. The only fucking thing keeping me alive in this fucking miserable world is this fucking drink. Excuse me, little dog. Oh. You know, guys, you know, since, since, I'm, since I'm such a fucking narcissist and I've got no fucking life and nothing else to do, no matter what I'm going to come talk to the few little imaginary friends I have left out there in cyber, just to tell you about my fucking day. This, this, this has been j j just one fucking day in my life, j just an average Monday in, 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 the, in the fucking life of Hamma and Little Tail. And I understand, guys, that this is an average day in all of our lives. This is the fucking shit that we put up with. I mean, from, from the fucking moment I fucking woke up this morning, th th this day, uh, th th this what, what should have been a beautiful fucking day, uh, it, 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 it's, just, it's just been one unbroken series of, uh, uh, of bullshit after fucking bullshit. It, it, it's unbelievable how the fucking bullshit just piles on the fucking bullshit. Just piles on the fucking bullshit. It just wears you the fuck down. It just wears you the fuck down. What do you think, little dog? Y you know, I, I want to fucking kill myself. It's, it's not fucking worth it. This whole suck-ass life. This isn't a fucking life. It, it, it's a never-ending series of, of, of everywhere you turn, everything you fucking touch turns to fucking bullshit. Just, just trying, trying to get through a fucking day. You know, dealing with, with this motherfucking wildfire smoke and and, 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 and and all of this fucking crap. Uh, you know, I've been sick as a fucking dog now for good God for going, what is it, three fucking months? <clears throat> been dealing with this fucking bullshit. So, I hear that my new computer is going to be delivered today. My new computer is going to be delivered today. And I say, okay, well, that's cool. So what I'm going to do, since I'm getting my new computer today, I'm going to call Best Buy and talk to my geek and get an appointment with my geek to set up my new computer. Okay. This seems like it would be that I should be able to pick up the motherfucking telephone call Best Buy, and make an appointment with my geek in Ithaca, New York. He, yeah, fucking right. There is no fucking way to call Best Buy, and it, it, it can't be done. You cannot get a fucking human being uh, to, to pick up a fucking phone, but you can get some motherfucker in India to, uh, to, to, to pick up a fucking telephone at, a, at Best Buy and, and to, to make you an appointment with the geek. So, I, so I'm talking to this motherfucker from India. Don't get me going on, 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 on fucking people from India. And uh, he says, I'll be glad to make you an appointment, but I, you, I cannot make an, a, fucking, a fucking appointment with Ben. I want, I, I want to see Ben. And uh, and uh, ain't gonna happen. And I said, I said, just fuck it, dude. I said I'm gonna get in my fucking car, drive 35 fucking minutes to Best Buy, so I can make an appointment 
with the motherfucker that I want to work on my computer. And he said, well, that, that's your only choice. And so I get in the fucking truck. And I say, okay, well, I got to do some other shit. You know, I wanted to buy, I, I, I knocked the fucking lamp off of my uh, nightstand, broke the fucking lamp. So I said, okay, I need to go to Habitat for Humanity, buy a fucking lamp. I, I, of course, I need to pick up some fucking sheets uh, at, at Habitat when, when, when I'm buying the fucking lamp. Uh, and, and, you know, shit like that. So I made some excuses, <clears throat> drive all the motherfucking way to Ithaca. All the fucking way to Ithaca. I, I go to the first goddamn Habitat for Humanity. Not a fucking lamp. Not a fucking lamp uh, in, in, in the whole goddamn store. So... Uh, they tell me, well, you know, there's a whole bunch of lamps uh, up at our other store, which happens to be uh, right down the street from fucking Best Buy. And I say, fine, I'm going to go up there. Uh, it, it, so I go outside, and, and, and I notice my tire is low on, uh, on my truck. <clears throat> I'm already pinched for time because I have people checking in. And they want to check in right at the fucking earliest check-in time at 3 o'clock this afternoon. I need to be back before 3 o'clock to, to deal with these goddamn people. To, to get them checked in it, it, here at Bugs in a Jar Farm. So uh, I've, 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 I'm already pinched for fucking time. So I strike out for a fucking $5 lamp at the first Best Buy. I go outside see my tire... As fuck as I, okay, I remember that you can get free air at Lowe's. You know, this is that you can. You it, it, at Lowe's, uh, you can get free air instead of paying two fucking dollars for air. And uh, so I test my tire, and, and and I've got 26 pounds of my tire. So I drive to fucking Lowe's. I don't need anything at Lowe's. All I need is fucking air. I, I drive to fucking Lowe's. Turn on the, the the little button for the free air, and, and and I push the little thing up against the fucking tire, and I and I think I'm putting air in my tire, but it feels like my fucking tire is getting flatter. So I sit there, sit there, sit there, and and, and I pull up thing, and, and, and what I so now my tire is at twenty two. Because the fucking, the little valve doesn't fit on my, or whatever the fuck. So now I've got 22 pounds of fucking air instead of 26. So now uh, I, I've got to sit there and go find a fucking air pump, uh, drive around and find, finding a fucking air pump, paying two fucking dollars to, to put the fucking air in my tire. I, I've wasted, good God, like like 30 fucking lows, the other, the goddamn place, doing all of this shit. So I, I get the fucking air in my tire, and I say, okay, so I'm going to drive to the other, to the other habitat, and uh, I say, well, I need a fucking lamp, I need another set of sheets, no shit, Sherlock, a lamp, a set of sheets, and I wanted to pick up a shirt while I was there. Lamp, sheet, shirts. Drive all the fucking way to that uh, to, to, to the, to the big, uh, Habitat for Humanity. Go all through there, there is one fucking lamp there. Nine fucking dollars, one fucking lamp, uh, that is small enough. To, so I, I, I go in there, I get the fucking lamp, <clears throat> and I go to the box of light bulbs to test the thing. I go through four fucking light bulbs. The fucking lamp doesn't work. It's a fucking piece of shit. It is what it is. It's a fucking piece of shit. <coughs> no fucking lamp. No fucking sheets. No fucking shirt. I have now struck out at two motherfucking uh, at, 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 at two motherfucking uh, Habitats for Humanity. 
And I say, well, the real reason I came to fucking Ithaca was, was to go to fucking Best Buy. This is way up the north side. It's in Lansing. It's not even in Ithaca. It's in fucking Lansing, New York. Uh, and uh, so, so now I'm an, an hour and a half since I left home. I've been gone an hour and a half. I, I probably burned up like 12, 13 bucks of fucking gas out my goddamn ass. I go in there to Best Buy. And this person, I honestly do not know. Not that it makes any difference because I don't really want to have sex with them. I have no clue if, if this thing in front of me was male or female. And, and what is it about Ithaca, fucking New York, where you have no idea? As I say, it's not that important, but you know, it's just 64 years of living. You expect to be talking to a man or a woman. I have no clue what this human was. No clue. What is it? Not even 100% sure it's human. So I tell this she, he, it, they, whatever the fuck this is, that I want an appointment with Ben. This thing looks at me and says, we, we don't have anybody named Ben working here. And, and, and I say, well, you did two months ago. Uh, I, I said, Ben was, was working here two months ago. So anyway, it goes round and round, claiming that nobody named Ben works there. I, I said, I need to see a fucking manager. I said, I drove a long fucking way up here. I've already been talking to fucking India. I, I, I paid your goddamn, what is it, uh, this $179 membership fee uh, to Best Buy and, and all that they rooked me into. I said, I want to, I need to talk to a fucking manager, someone with a fucking brain who can get me an appointment with Ben here. And uh, so the manager comes up or says, can I help you, sir? And I go through the whole fucking story. And she tells me there is no way to make an appointment with Ben. Same thing that the dude from India had told me, that there is no fucking way. And, and, and I said, is Ben here? And she goes, no, he comes in on Wednesday. And, and I said, fine. I said, make an appointment uh, with Ben on Wednesday. Can't do it. Can't fucking do it. And I said, I want you, I said, listen, you fucking cunt. Well, obviously I said that under my breath. Uh, I, 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 I said, you make me a fucking appointment with a motherfucking geek here Wednesday afternoon. And when I get here, it better goddamn well be Ben. You fucking bitch. And, and uh, so uh, she puts me down at a point. She goes, sir, I'm, I'm not promising you. I'm going to shut the fuck up. So I, I get him out. I, I have made a, a completely wasted trip to a completely wasted trip to uh, to uh, Ithaca. I, I have spent, I was gone for two hours and 15 minutes uh, don't know how much money, and, and came back completely empty-handed. I come back to find a note on the door from UPS that they tried to deliver my computer, but nobody was home to sign for it, so they took it back to the warehouse. There, there were two people in this goddamn house all day today, I uh, never heard a UPS truck, a uh, big fucking truck. And so, and so, and so I'm thinking that, that maybe it was the it was the post office. So I get on and do all of this shit, you know, with the fucking tracking number and all of this. They can't find the fucking dragon. They don't know what the hell's going on. And, and, and so the robot, because you can't talk to a real person, so the robot... Uh, it tells me that maybe that that some packages are delivered 
uh, some packages are delivered by the post office. So I go out to the mailbox, which I haven't been out to in a month, uh, to see if there's a note from the from the postman, and and this is what's waiting for me uh, in the mailbox. I have not looked at my mail for over a month. Uh, I've been piling up in the fucking mailbox, and there there's no message. So I I, I write out this long letter. Of course, the, the fucking post office is closed. I drive all the way to the fucking post office, leave a message on the door of the post office. If you've got my fucking computer, motherfuckers, keep it right here, and I will come sign for it tomorrow. And uh, come on, you, you would not believe what, what I've fucking gone through uh, uh, over here. So, trying to find where my motherfucking package is. And it says right on the note that you go in to UPS.com and, 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 and you, you can fill out this little thing. You can't do it on the, on the, on the sheet of paper to fill out this thing uh, authorizing for them to leave the package off with no signature. It, it's not like that, that they can leave me a note just check here or sign for it now. You know what, like they used to on the fucking video. So I start out on this process. All I fucking want to do is just in case that this fuck up happens again tomorrow, I, 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 I want them to leave the fucking package off uh, with, with no signature required. Good fucking God what that set off. I, you know, I had to uh, to enroll in UPS.com, do all of these motherfucking usernames and, and fucking passwords, all of this shit, go through all of this fucking shit, follow their prompts. There is nowhere, nowhere, it, it cannot be done uh, about the fucking signature. So I get on the little chat robot. The, the fucking chat robot. Uh, I, I, I spend all that time with the fucking little chat robot and saying, listen, you, you fucking little robot. There's, you, you keep saying uh, to go do it, and there's no fucking, there is no way to do it. And, and so the fucking robot gives up and says, that's all I can do for you. You're shit out of luck. Uh, <clears throat> so I get the robot to get me to a real person. Unbelievable. You, you can't call them, but you leave your number with the robot. So 45 minutes later, I get a call. You can take a wild guess where the fucking call was from. It wasn't from Ithaca, New York. It was from fucking India. I'm back on with another motherfucker from India. And, and, and I get around and around and around. And, and I say, dude, I said, all I fucking want you to do, and, and this this was like, uh, and, and I have spent, but because uh, nobody in the fucking house heard the guy uh, trying to deliver that computer to sign for it, I have spent, well, including the drive to the, I would say pretty much two hours trying to get where I don't have to, no one has to sign for the fucking thing. So I get this motherfucker for a minute. We're on the phone for 30 minutes trying to figure out how. We get on there and he's like, no problem. Uh, and, and we're on that motherfucking phone. I'm on, on, the, on the fucking phone for over 30 minutes to fucking India simply trying to leave instructions to, to, the, to the motherfucking... Uh, driver tomorrow that if that if nobody's there to sign when he gets here to leave the fucking package it cannot be done uh, the, the the motherfucker from India uh, like I, I don't know what's going on I, I have no idea uh, what's going on here he wants me to to patch me over to fucking tech support and uh that was where that fucking phone call ended. And then I start going through my fucking mail. Good 
fucking god. So, let's see. What, what, what do I have here? I have this thing from Progressive Insurance that I guess now the insurance on that fucking camper is expired. A uh, big fucking deal. So I have no insurance on, on, on that fucking little camper that just sits out in the yard anyway. So there's $172, I guess. Uh, no, no, no fucking... Uh, it, 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 anyway, uh, so I've got no insurance there, and then I get in that is from the flood insurance people that uh, my policy this year is going up to nine hundred and eighty-eight dollars. I uh, <clears throat> I got flood insurance on this little shack by the side of the road. What was it, Sancho? Three years ago. It was six hundred dollars. Now they're holding out their fucking hand, essentially for one thousand fucking dollars, to uh, for 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 the goddamn uh, flood insurance. And I have like three weeks to figure that out. Then then I get the fucking thing from the driver's license from from, from the fucking DMV. Uh, telling me that that my fucking driver's license has expired, which is unadulterated fucking horseshit. It, it's an eight-year driver's license in New York. Uh, I, I wasn't in New York, but anyway, you know, I've been in fucking New York. It was five years ago. Uh, uh, five years ago, I got my driver's license. And then uh, when I moved here, then, then four years ago, uh, I, I got another driver's license. Now, now, now they're telling me uh, that I got to go down to the fucking DMV, get, get a fucking driver's license. Uh, there's fucking $65. Uh, there, then I get, uh, I get reissued my fucking Medicare card. Where, where they took that motherfucking Part B off of it, uh, and, 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 and they send me this, and, and of course, Social Security or Medicare or something, you know, talking about, well, we see that you elected uh, to cancel your, your Part B, you clueless fucking moron, so we, uh, we, we pulled you off of Part B, uh, and, and you're fucked. Uh, good God, what and I have like uh, five credit card offers here, uh, whatever the fuck. Some it, 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 it fucking goes on and on and on and on and on. That this entire fucking day has been one big clusterfuck. It's just a minute. I fucking woke up 14 fucking hours ago. <clears throat> I still have no computer. I have an appointment with somebody on Wednesday at 1.30. I need to get my hands on this fucking computer by 1.30 on fucking Wednesday. Then I got to go and then get a fucking driver's license and a thousand dollars of fucking flood insurance and, 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 and then the fucking twelve hundred dollar auto insurance policies coming up I'm feeling like I never paid my fucking taxes last year I, I honestly don't know uh, you, you know guys it, 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 it's, it's, it's just it's just fucking bullshit Yes, little dog? What have you been doing today? You say, Bob? Not about a fine day. I've been chasing chippies. There were some mousies. And there were some chippies. I ate some chicken. I chased some chippies. And uh, it's been a pretty good day. I had a fun ride to the post office. That was fun. I slept on the couch while you went to Ithaca because it was too fucking hot. Ah, fuck. Alright, little dog. 
you, you know, uh, God, what are we? Malcontents. We are a society of what is it? Angry, lonely, atomized malcontents. I hate this. I hate every, everything about this fucking bullshit. I just want to lie down in that fucking bed. I want to fucking go to sleep. And I do not want to wake up tomorrow and do this again. This is not a fucking life. Okay? It's a life sentence. It's a fucking life sentence. This whole fucking day has been nothing but fucking bullshit. Pure bullshit. Jesus fucking Christ, my fucking life. Look at this fucking life. My God.